I am still trying to figure out how to use a webcam. Um, I just wanted to share a few things with you. Um, good morning, by the way. My name is Courtney, if you guys don't know me. I swear, I do normally wear clothes that match. Um, today is laundry day, so right now all of my clothes are in the, um, in the washing machine and that is why today's video is not a fashion um, type of video, which those are rare for me. However, I do sell uh, t-shirts, I'll put a link to it, and they look great, blue jeans. But anyway, um, this morning I wanted to talk about my journey with Spinraza a little bit. Um, the insurance company approved it, um, and now I still haven't been scheduled yet, waiting to see what happens. I'm hoping I can get um, dosed before I go back to work on the 7th. But we shall see. Um, anyway, I will share with you guys all about that um, and like the whole situation, the whole story after I get dosed. Like I think I mentioned before, I don't want to hurt like my chances or anything and going through a whole long ordeal right now. But anyway, it my last maintenance dose of Spinraza was on July 20th. So it's been July, September, I don't remember. December, um, five months, almost six months since I last received Spinraza. Um, so anyway, I wanted to share with you like what my experience has been like. I haven't noticed too, too much of a difference so far. Um, I think a lot of it's still in my system. I'm very worried about having to go through the whole maintenance dose process again because that's a, it's kind of a long process and I can't take that much time off work. Anyway, and I would really like, like I'm off right now for two weeks, I'd really like to be dosed while I'm off and not have to take any additional time off work. Anyway, ah, uh, rant over. Sorry, I'm really frustrated if you can't tell. What is that? So basically what I've noticed is like my energy levels are ugh, way down. When I was first receiving Spinraza, they were like, whoa, I had a ton of energy, ready to go, do whatever. Now I'm like, I didn't really use a nap right now, and I just got up two hours ago. So we'll see. But anyway, here's what I could do before. Um, I'll see if I have a new video editor program. I'll see if I can put it side by side. We'll see. But anyway, I'm getting that from the chair without my hands. Oh, yeah, I can still do that. Okay, that I could do after my first dose of Spinraza. I couldn't do that before. I'm sitting back down. Oh, I can do that. Kind of difficult. Uh, one thing I was super excited to do last time was uh, a, like getting in a squat. I haven't tried it. I sprained my ankle right before Thanksgiving, so I haven't really done anything with that. I haven't tried it since before I sprained my ankle, so I don't know. We'll see. Let's see here. If I can still do that. Okay. Ooh. Ow. Okay, so yes. Um. That just informed me I really need to stretch out my legs um, because man they are tight my goodness but um so I can still do a squat not as long as I could before I think it was like 30 seconds and and getting up from the ground let's see here can you guys see not really here, bring it forward sorry about all the cat toys I got all these toys for my cat for Christmas, and um, she does not want to play with them. Typical cat, right? Anyway, getting up. I can go like this, um, sort of. Uh, nope. Mm -mm. Can't get up on that side. Let's see about the other side. Let's say, uh-uh, can't get up on that side. Um. I forget, like, what, a, oh, getting up from the ground, right, okay, well, I'll show you guys that in a minute, um, well, this feels like a great stretch, so I'm gonna stay here and chat with you for a minute, um, I'm very concerned about losing, like, the abilities, and I've noticed I've been tripping again, um, about, like, losing the abilities that I've gained since being on Spinraz, I'm concerned about that, I'm actually really happy to know I haven't lost those yet, um, and then, also, like I said, I'm nervous about having to go through the whole loading dose process again. That's pretty, that would be pretty insane um, and intense. And 
Oh my goodness, I'm sorry guys, this feels like really good. I did not realize how tight my legs were. I haven't really stretched or done my PT exercises in a little while. Because like with the holidays, it's been kind of hectic. Um, this is kind of my first chance to just relax a little bit. Anyway, where was I? Oh yeah, getting up from the ground. So, um, that's something I want to try this year, by the way, is getting into a plank and staying there. Speaking of planks, that's how I get up from the ground. This push my hands back, walk my feet in. Oh, ow! And I'm up. My goodness, like I said, I I really need to stretch. Um, but anyway, so that's what um that I guess it's not too too bad of uh, not having received a dose for five months. So. The process is for every four months, so we'll see what happens. Um, I think they're working on getting it for me now. Like I said, they did let me know that it's been approved, so that's a good thing. It's just a matter of when, and I will keep you guys all updated. Um, there's so much that I don't know right now, and... Um, there's so much that I want to share with you guys, but I definitely feel like I should probably wait until after everything happens. So, like I said, I'll keep you guys updated. Um, subscribe for updates if you're not already. Thank you to all of you that are. I hope you guys all had a great Christmas. And we can chat about Christmassy stuff maybe tomorrow. That would be fun. Alright guys, have a great day, a great weekend if I don't get a chance to hop on, and stay safe.